Good morning, guys. This is gonna be our first day in Oahu. Our first full day because we arrived here last evening, so. We're gonna go get breakfast now. It is a late start to our morning. It's like 11.30. I'll show you guys more of the place that we're staying at after this because I didn't start this video until like right now. But we're gonna go get breakfast at this really cool food kind of area plaza. It's where they have a bunch of like food trucks and restaurants and there's this really cool cafe that we looked at yesterday when we ate dinner there. So we're going back. I will update you guys when we're there. We just got our food at the cutest cafe. Here's what I got the avocado toast. Mom got the aloha. We have salad. And Liz got French toast. No, vegan waffle. Oh, vegan waffle. That looks really good. This is probably the most colorful thing I've ever seen. That's so pretty. We're meeting Greg and Waikiki tonight for dinner. My mom's friend who lives here in Oahu. So we're really, really excited to meet him because my mom hasn't seen him in like, Seven years, yeah. We don't want to spend too much time in the downtown city, which is why we're staying in North Shore, just because we're not really interested in it much, but today we're really gonna to try to do our shopping, eating there, and then we might drive in another day as well, but we're not gonna be spending much time in here, so. We're on our way in the tiny car. Liz now wants to be in the video because she looks presentable. It is now 2.50. It's been like a bit since we've had our late breakfast, but just wanted to update you guys. We are at the Aloha Steakhouse. We're seated in like the outside portion where the resort is because it's connected to a hotel. So that's pretty cool. We just got the charcuterie board and this, what is this Joey? Perfect. Appetizer. Got back to our place and the lights are flickering really really creepily. We're gonna go up and see what this is. Hey guys, it's the next morning. I just woke up and I still have my makeup on from yesterday, so I might as well video it before I wash it off. I fell asleep and passed out like immediately last night because I was so tired after coming home from Waikiki. I didn't record at all after dinner because it was just a lot going on. We walked around the city a lot. The sunset was so, so pretty. Probably the prettiest one ever. Actually, the one on the first night was prettier, but the sunsets here have been so, so consistently beautiful. It's kind of loud out here because of the AC unit, but I'm gonna show you guys the tour of the house. So this is the front door right here. When you open it up, it has this front balcony area. All of our shoes are outside, but here's the view from the front patio. It's so, so pretty with all the palm trees and blue skies right now. When you open up the door, you come into the main area. And then to your left, when you first walk in, there's this pantry kind of thing. And it has pretty much everything you could possibly need. Turning this way, we have the kitchen. I apologize if some things are not clean because we've been living here for two days now. We have the fridge here, nothing in it yet because we still need to go grocery shopping. And the coffee maker, stove. The only weird thing we've noticed about this kitchen is that it doesn't have a microwave. But besides that, it's quite nice. And then turning from the kitchen and the cabinet, over here, when you walk in once again, there's this little table right here where you can have your breakfast with the fan over here. AC unit's under there, that's why it's kind of loud. And then there's this really cute decoration. I love this so, so much. It's got like little succulents in it. There's like this really cool wooden stairway. My mom and sister are up there on the loft. I will show you guys after. But when you walk down this hallway, there is the laundry room right here. You got the washer and you got the dryer. And then these 
these three mirrors, which I think is so, so cute down the hallway like this. Then you turn in over here and this is the bathroom and we have these double sinks and this really nice long mirror. And then this is the really nice shower and we just have all of our stuff in here. That's pretty much it for the bathroom. And then you walk into this back room area, which I think is so nice. Joey's right there on the chair. This is the messiest room probably of all because my suitcase is right there in the middle. And there's this really cool TV right here. Here is the back patio. This is where I was standing a little bit ago. And then there's these really cute shelves. I'm gonna scoot by here. And then over there behind this thing, which usually moves out over there, there's another one of those succulent plant things. And now I'm gonna show you guys the loft over there, which we can actually talk to each other from the top and bottom. This thing is super, super steep, so. And here is the loft area. So it overlooks basically the whole house. I think this is so cool. It's actually kind of loud up here because that fan's on. And then to the left, there's the bed area. I will leave you guys alone now. Getting down this is kind of like scary though. I'm not gonna lie. I will talk to you guys soon. I'm gonna go get ready. Currently shopping for groceries. Oh, there's a cat here on my lens. You seen it? <laughs> Freaking blow. Shopping. We're gonna give you guys a grocery haul. First got some salmon, baked spinach. Hey, Liz, do you wanna say anything about this ramen? I just excited to eat it. That's it? You're just excited to eat it? Yeah. It's always out of stock for me, We got some eggs. Got some kani, what they use in uh, California. Oh. Fried tofu skin with rice underneath. The sushi like looks so good here, and Joey got this roll. <laughs> I also got a roll, but I already ate it. Why don't we get cheese? Some local Hawaiian chips. I got some poke. We got the coffee. We got granola bars. We got tuna. Woo! There's a bug in the fridge! He's just chilling. We got a local like pineapple bananas. Also got a mini watermelon because this is all what they had. But that pretty much concludes this haul. Here's my amazing lunch. <laughs> basically just gonna watch the sunset here so we are on sunset beach should be good this beach is also really really pretty how gold the sand is it's so pretty and joey's out there he's gonna go snorkeling and see what's in the water basically oh. We're back in the resort area. Joey's at the pool, but we're gonna bring Mattel because he forgot. But Liz and my mom and I are gonna just stay in the house. Guys, look at the turtle. It looks like it's a real turtle in the water, but they're like part of the tile. And they even put a cast shadow on it, so it looks really realistic. I think it's really cool because we are in Turtle Bay, so like turtle theme. That was a really big splash. That literally got on me. It's on my camera too, I can see a water spot. Anyways. another day in Oahu. Currently 10.52 a.m. We definitely woke up on the later side today. If any of you guys have any like dry skin, like phobias of like skin peeling, maybe skip this part. I'm gonna show you guys my thighs, which burned so badly in Kauai. This kind of looks like a bottom of a crunch bar. It's peeling so badly and it's like taking away my tan with it too. And that is why you wear sunscreen. Even if you are in a convertible with the wind keeping you cool, because that's what happened. It's only on the top part of my thighs. Like the rest of my leg is completely fine. It's a little bit later. I just made some coffee. I'm waiting for my mom and Joey to get back from the Bay Area Resort. They went wandering around earlier this morning. They just scared me and came in. <laughs> I wonder if the gecko is still here. Yeah. Is he under that car? Oh my god, he is. There he is. Isn't he so cute? Oh.
building right now. I've heard that the acai bowls here are just really, really good. We're gonna go like shop around in this surf town because there's a lot of shopping centers in this downtown area on North Shore. I need to get souvenirs for my friends, so need to do that. It is another day in Oahu. I haven't been videoing as soon as I got up, but we got up pretty early today. We got up at 8 a.m. Usually we get up at like 10 or 11 a.m. I got coffee with my mom from Coffee Bean and Tea Leaf. I don't know, it was the coffee shop in Foodland here on the North Shore and it was actually really, really good coffee. But we ended up getting chocolate chips because we forgot to get chocolate chips for the pancakes. And it is now 9.30. I'm all awake now and I'm gonna get some food going because I'm hungry. I just usually bring this tote. I also am wearing a normal outfit on top of my bathing suit because we're going into the town Kailua. It's on the east side of Oahu. They have this really pretty nice white beach all along the strip of it. And then there's also a Goodwill and nice shopping area around it. So we're gonna try to go thrifting. Anyways, let's get going. I look insane right now with my hair up and then my beach towel still wrapped around me because we went to the pool and the beach and I'm still wearing my bathing suit and I want to shower and not change into clothes until I shower so I look like this and I'm cooking. This looks really really good. I don't know why it looks extremely red on camera. I will talk to you guys all later. I'm gonna eat this and get everyone down here. The next day, Greg came to visit us in North Shore. He lives down near Waikiki. We filmed some fitness content at Turtle Bay Resort because Greg is a personal trainer and we also ate lunch there. My mom and I also went to the Sunrise Shack for breakfast earlier that morning and now on to later that evening. I am with the Greg. Hey. Oh, Greg's mom's Aloha. Aloha. Mahalo nui ho. This is my mom's friend who actually lives here in Oahu. Yeah. So, the Greg Hall. Of course. fitness. And he has this Greg Hall's a fitness program. I kind of want you guys to like know about it and get some details about it. I will leave links and everything to his stuff down below in the description box. This is the YouTube queen, the princess. <laughs> She's first team, all that. So tell them what is Greg's Hall's of Greg's Hall of Fitness is a way, a channel to look at that will give you safe, efficient, functional fitness. Maybe you don't want to go to the box gym. Maybe you don't want to go online and do a hit program. Maybe Maybe you don't want to do CrossFit, but maybe you need something, you can start it, a template, something. It is I with a beautiful hair. <laughs> You do sessions with clients here in Oahu, right? Yes, I do. I don't know who watches me in Hawaii, but he's here in Oahu. Look me up. Give me a call. <laughs> give me a ring. Give me a text. Yeah, we did actually some training today at Turtle Bay. We definitely recorded a bunch of stuff and we did a butt workout. A woman doesn't want to work on her glutes. <laughs> hey, guys want to work on their glutes. But I'll have the links to what we did today also in the description box. It'll all be on his channel. I'm really tired Caitlin of Caitlin killed it. Did you hear me? C-I-L-L. -L. Kill. You killed it, Mama Sita. Thank you. Yeah. I just wanted you guys to kind of meet Greg and my mom's friend. I'm not your friend my... too? I'm just your mom's friend. I thought we were friends too. We are. We've been filming all day. But okay. we've never met before until now. Well, okay. I knew her when she was this big. Now she's got the lovely hair. And... <laughs> Check her out, check me out, check yeah, us all definitely. out. Yeah, definitely. Aloha, mahalo. 
it is our last day in Oahu. It's also basically our last day in Hawaii. We're going home today. We will be flying home out tonight at 9.35 p.m. So we have to check out at 10 a.m. We're gonna wake up. I'm currently packing up the rest of my bag, trying to make everything fit and accessible throughout the day because we might be doing hiking, swimming, a bunch of other stuff today. So I need stuff in my bag to be accessible. I'm like so tired. And we're out. I don't know how to say it because there's a really long like name and I'll put it on the screen right now Look how small the cars are compared to these mountains. We have all of our stuff like jam-packed in the car. There's Liz Looks like a green screen behind me. Look We're on our way to Waikiki now and downtown because we're gonna do some last minute shopping And I think we're gonna meet up with Greg. That is pretty much it. It's probably the last of the mountains that I'm gonna see and meet Greg here. We also went shopping. We're returning our car now. This is the car return area. I'm very, very sad I don't wanna leave, but this is finally happening. I can't believe it after two and a half weeks. going home now. We're all sitting on the floor charging our phones and we're just waiting at the gate behind Liz to board. We made it to Denver, Colorado and now we're making our last flight to DC. Obviously been home for a while now and going through the footage I'm now realizing I didn't really close out this video I'm gonna do that But I also want to show you guys what I got while I was in Hawaii and I'm not gonna go into too much detail But just briefly kind of talk about it I feel like when I look back on this when I'm older I would also like to see a haul portion of what I got the first thing I did obviously do is get a lot of t-shirts Little things for my friends. So I'm not really gonna show you all the stuff I got for them The first thing I got myself though was this shirt and it has this little Little design here but I'll show you on the back because it's the same exact thing it just says Hawaii and then I liked how it had all the islands on the bottom of it and it's brown and I love brown so so much there's also this store called crazy shirts and I got a few things from them they basically dye their shirts in like weird kind of fun things my favorite one by far is this one it says North Shore like look how beautiful that is I just love the blue and it's actually a bit tan because it is coconut dyed which I thought was pretty cool. I also got this one with a lizard on it and I got two more but they're not currently in my room right now so I'm sorry about that. And then I also got these flower clips. I am never gonna wear these where I live. There's nothing to wear these to but I mean if you've been to Hawaii you know that these flowers are pretty much everywhere and I wanted to remember that so I did get one of these hair clips. I also got one for my friend Emily so that's why I have two. And then at the airport my mom decided to really push me into getting a lei and I'm so glad she did because it's probably one of my favorite things. 
This is like a really, really nice lay as well. I know you wouldn't be able to find anything similar to this where I live. There were some lays though that did look a little party city like, but this one was a lot more, it's just a lot nicer and a lot more authentic looking. I'm once again, not gonna wear it outside of my house for anything really, but I do plan on putting this like on a shelf. It has like a lot of meaning behind it from the trip. So I'm just really glad I got this. I also got this mug. You can kind of see all the islands on it. We obviously saw this in the hair clip, but I really, really liked this one that I saw there. It's already open, I'm sorry about that, but this is what it looks like. It's so, so pretty. You know me, I love my gold jewelry, and I just thought this was so pretty and dainty and obviously has meaning behind it, and I did get a second one in silver for my friend Janelle. I know she would like this. If you watch my Kawaii vlog, you would know that we went to Kawaii Juice Co. I decided to just keep the glass for it. I just thought it was a cool souvenir, so I'm including that in this haul. And you guys also know we visited my mom's friend, Greg, and he did give my mom and sister and me and also Joey gifts individually. Everything's all around my room, but he gave it in this like super cool and nice bag and it has Greg's Hall of Fitness right in the front of it. And I just think it's also such a nice bag and it's empty now because all this stuff is all around my room in different places. But he also gave me this really cool hat. It also says Greg's Hall of Fitness, which is his like fitness program. I actually have the flyer for it right here. So if you want to, actually you would have heard more about this because I think I put this clip of him talking about it in this video. It was really nice to visit him and it was super nice that he gave us such thoughtful gifts. He gave us so much more stuff, but I mean, it's everywhere around my room. It's such a mess right now and I really do need to clean it. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if you've watched all the other Hawaii videos, thank you so much as well. I've been putting a lot of extra time and effort into editing these videos and I just hope you guys appreciate it and enjoy it. But that is pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it up to this point, comment down below this secret emoji. I really like doing this to know who's actually watching up to the end of my videos because I appreciate that. And subscribe to my channel if you want to. I would also really appreciate that. I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye!